Hi, I'm Josh Mahar with Kansas State Research and Extension, and today I'm going to show you how to use a test to monitor the cleanliness of your harvesting packing and uh, harvesting equipment. And we're going to be using harvesting containers, and the green one here has been cleaned and sanitized using the appropriate methods. And then the blue container over here has simply just been rinsed of, rinsed of any sort of soil or uh, debris, and we're basically going to test how clean are these containers. For today's test, we're going to be using an, uh, a clean trace ATP meter and ATP swab. And so I'm gonna go ahead and start with the blue container here that has just been rinsed. So I'm just going to take a quick surface sample here of the container. And one of the benefits of using this types of, type of equipment is the test is almost instantaneous. So it's a very rapid and quick test and very accurate. So shaking that around a little bit here, go ahead and insert our swab into the ATP meter, press start. And in a matter of seconds here, we have a reading of 1,263 RLUs. Okay, and moving on to the harvest container that was cleaned and sanitized uh, using appropriate soaps and detergents, as well as the sanitizer following the specific label instructions. And so we're gonna go ahead and take a representative sample of the same area as we did in the previous container. Making sure to twist our swab around. And then capping the swab shaking the reagent around, and place it into our ATP meter. And so this specific piece of equipment is used for measuring ATP. And ATP is something that is used in, and present in all organic material and life as well. So it could be an indication of bacteria, it could be an indication of plant material, um, but it's definitely an indicator of cleanliness. So we'll go ahead and press start here on the measurement. And then for the cleaned and sanitized bin, we see an, a, a 91 RLUs compared to the 1,200 RLUs for our simply rinse container. So basically this demonstration shows us that there is a very significant difference when you are simply rinsing your harvesting tools and packaging tools uh, and equipment versus properly cleaning and sanitizing. And so um, we here at Kansas State Research and Extension just want to stress how the importance of these types of safety measures, not only for yourself, but for um, the end user as well of your commodities. Um, thank you very much for watching and appreciate your time.